Empire of Cotton situates the development of the North American economy in a truly global context. This is a continent that was built by cotton to a great extent, built by slave labor and integrated into a whole world system. The Empire of Cotton is a, is a deeply researched account of the rise of global capitalism as seen through the prism of the development of the uh, cotton industry by means of what he calls global capitalism, which is the control of labor, the domination of markets and the acquisition of land by force. The book at the end it makes an eloquent plea for the enlightened regulation of global capitalism because he shows all the interconnections in, in, in the development of it and how decisions taken in one part of the world can have appalling implications at another part of the world. But really the regulation of it isn't managed at a global level. The politics is still local and regional. This is a really innovative history of the origins really of modern capitalism, but it's told through the life story, as it were, of a commodity. And the commodity is cotton. And Becker brilliantly shows how this one commodity generated the industrial capitalist world in which we still live today. Empire of Cotton is a terrific book that shows how a focus on one commodity can help us understand the making of the modern world. And he focuses on the extent to which cotton became really the catalyst for international global connections that linked economy and empire. And I think it's also a wonderful illustration of the fact that globalization today is not a new phenomenon, but in fact has links back. And it relates to ways that we often don't think. That is to say how slavery, for example, was really at the heart of the Industrial Revolution. And it gives us new insights to the great transformations of the 19th century. I have not read a book on the subject of how cotton actually became the biggest Thing in, uh, in the 19th century worldwide. And I thought from that point of view, uh, it was a brilliant book. And you come away from it with a different perception of the world. And I think that's uh, worth considering for a prize.